Today we decided to do something special for everybody so they can see it. Most people have never seen a block of C4. We've got a little over two pounds inside of the TCB. That's a total of David Bethel. We can put 15 pounds in there every day, 25 pounds one time. It's made of HY80 steel, the same steel used for submarines, so it'll expand. So I could be right beside it with a robot standing and set it off. As long as I got air protection, I'll be fine. But if you touch that spear while it sits off, it'll shatter all the bones in your arm. The poundage we have in there, if we set 127 feet away from it, it gives a 10 PSI and it will rupture your lung and you would die. So the reason that we use the TCV, when we go to a neighborhood, it's hard to get a football field when we go into a neighborhood. That's $300,000 a piece of equipment. We got it on the grant. Before COVID, we were using it two to three times a year. As long as you understand what causes this stuff to go off, it's more stable than the HME. Now the HME, when we start talking about homemade explosives, that's when we get scared because somebody is making those things off the internet. They're making it from stuff you can go to Home Depot with. Those things are unsafe. That's why the TCB is so important that you can blow stuff inside there once we get the robot. And the robot's going to close the door. It has an automatic switch on it so that we don't have to go down range. Show, ladies and gentlemen, the rest of us are clean up. So I'm glad y'all get to come out. Got any questions? Give us a shout.